हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड अस्सलाम वालेकुम वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई वी ऑल डिजाइनिंग डेवलपर माय नेम इज इंशाल बेग आई एम अ फुल स्टैक डेवलपर एंड ग्राफिक डिजाइनर लाइक इन प्रीवियस प्रोजेक्ट वी हैव लर्न दैट हाउ टू बिल्ड वन वर्ड लेंथ कैलकुलेटर इन जावास्क्रिप्ट एंड आई होप यू ऑल एंजॉयड दैट प्रोजेक्ट नाउ इन दिस प्रोजेक्ट वी विल सी दैट हाउ टू बिल्ड वन कंटेंट फॉर्म इन जावास्क्रिप्ट एंड आई होप यू विल आल्सो एंजॉय दिस प्रोजेक्ट लाइक इन एंजॉय योर प्रीवियस प्रोजेक्ट ऑफ जावास्क्रिप्ट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट नाउ ओवर हियर यू कैन सी आई हैव जस्ट मेड इट दिस कांटेक्ट फॉर्म in javascript okay so in this contact form over here if i just write my name over here okay so now in that i will write my name and over here if i just write my email and here if i write my message okay so if i write like my name okay so i will write my name is inshal bey okay and if i press send okay so it will be just sent and if i press reset okay so if i just press that so over here you can see now my all things are clear okay name email and message all things are clear over here okay so i will just show you how to build that so over here first of all you have to open your tag editor which is called brackets and you have to just go to file which i have just created today.html today.css and today.js okay so over here i have just already linked my style sheet and my javascript sheet with my script tag and with my link Uh, tag i have just linked my css sheet okay so i will just come underneath my link tag and over here i will just write my all the codes which i have to write so i will just come and i will write h1 and now over here i will come and over here i will first of all write contact form okay which was written so i will just do like that and now i will come underneath that and now just if i show you again in the google chrome so over here there was written name email and message okay so i will come over here and i will just write name then i will copy this okay and i will paste that two times okay so over here i will just paste that and over here i will add email okay so come over here and add email then write over here message okay so i will write message so now when you have done that just you have to hit save and now we have done till over here right over here input and just you have to do like that and just you have to do like that okay so just you have to copy that and just paste that two times over here so over here we will not write any of the placeholder okay so over here i will just hit save from here and i will just come and i will write button and over here i will write send okay and i will write send first of all then i will just copy this button tag over here okay and i will paste that one time and then i will just change this send to reset okay reset okay so i will write over here reset then you have to hit save over here and now when you have done that just your html has been done okay so we have link our style sheet so now here we have to write about css tags so i will just go over here and i will just come and i will first of all write margin okay Which should be zero. So I will come over here and I will add margin zero pixel. Right padding should be also zero pixel. Then right over here like box sizing. Okay, so I will add box sizing should be border box. Come over here right justify content in center. Okay, and just you have to right over here align items in center. And I will write like just come over here and write display flex. Okay, so I will write display should be flex. So it should be in one row means in one line. And I will first of all write font size again, which should be. 12 pixel right over here font weight should be like 400 and just come over here and write font family okay which should be mont sirat so i will write mont sirat okay so right over here mont sirat then write comma okay and just you have to do like that write comma then set serif now when you have done that all just you have to do like that okay so right over here just again you have to write flex wrap should be wrap over here okay so when you have done that just you have to do like that just you have to do like come over here again and write body okay then in that i will again write font family which should be same which i have written so i will write mont sirat over here also then i will just write comma and write sans serif so over here i will just uh, take it to small okay so i will just come over here and i will write font size should be 13 pixel then write font weight should be 500 because i need all the font weight font size So it should be different of each other. Okay, so I will just come over here and I will add flex wrap. Should be no wrap now. Okay, so I will add no wrap. So just you have to do like that, and just you have to add semicolon. Then write no wrap. Then come over here and write text align center, and write over here like justify content in center. So just come over here and write justify content in center. Okay, so when you have done that, just you have to come over here and write align items in center. Okay, and just you have to write over here. Okay, so just come over here and write display flex. So it should be in one row. Okay, so now when you have done that, just you have to hit save from here. Okay, so we have done till over here. Okay, so now here when you have done that all, just you have to come and write border. Okay, so write over here border should be one pick solid and should be white. Okay, so I will write one pick solid and white. Then come over here and write border color should be white. Okay, and write over here outline none. Okay, so I will write outline none. 
so many of them that just you have to do like that hit save and just uh, hit save from here and just right over here input tab okay so i will add input then come over here and that padding should be like 5 pixel right margin should be 7 pixel okay so i will just come and i will add 7 pixel then come over here and write width of like uh, i will first of all write 100 percent then uh, i will just write 80 percent okay so just come over here and write outline none then right over here border none okay so because i don't want any border in there so i will add border none and over here i will add background color should be white then it will be just change automatically with the help of our tag with the input okay so i will just write background then also over here i will add uh, white over here so i will just hit save so now your css has been also done so here we have to just work with our javascript work so i will just write first of all function tag and i will come over here and i will add const okay then with const i will add body equal to document dot query selector so i will add query document first of all right and right over here dot query selector then you have to come over here and write over here body just you have to come over here and write const and write over here again document and just write over here equal document okay so write over here document dot query selector and now here you have to come and write over here document so i will write document then you have to do like that come over here and write const and i will just write function tag over here equal and i will just write document okay so just write over here document dot query selector then you have to come over here and just uh, spelling is incorrect so i will just take it to like that and just write over here y okay so when you've done that come over here and write another thing which is called function so i will write function over here now we have done till over here just when you've done that come over here write function dot add email listener so i will write add email listener over here just come over here write button comma and write over here e tag and i will just write dot on click and i will just write function tag in there okay? so when you've done that come over here and just uh, control z you have to press then control z again now when you've done that just write over here like document and write over here dot button and write on click comma function tag and I come over here and write floor dot net dot random and now just come over here again and write function dot document and write over here button again so i will add button and comma and write over here random and in that i will add floor dot math dot length okay so i will add length and just we have to do like that okay so i will just take my m capital okay because it should be in capital just come over here and write random and just you have to come and write dot and just write over here button okay so i will write button e dot and write over here floor and just write over here length okay so when you've done that just write over here function and just you have to come over here and write on click okay so write dot length okay so now when you've done that just have to do like that okay so you have done till over here so press backspace over here now when you've done that all just you have to hit save so now it is enough just when you've done that you have to just copy this and you have to paste that okay so i will just paste that over here again and over here so over here just take to backspace over here and just backspace over here and just like that you have to write over here also okay so just come over here and press backspace so now when you've done that just you have to come and write like that again okay so just you have to do like that and take it to backspace over here so now we have done till over here okay so now when you've done that all just you have to come over here and just do like that now it is done just you have to hit save and now when you've done that all things just you have to uh, come over here and just go to js file and now when you've done that just you have to go to google chrome okay so over here you can see we have just made it this contact form in javascript okay so over here you can see there is written please contact me over here and now if i write my name okay in shalbeg then email and over here if i write like message uh, my name is inshal Bay, okay and just come over here and write like that and over here if i press send okay so now it will be sent and if i press reset so now you can see it has been reset and all the things are gone then you will you can write another name email and message if you want to okay so like that you can make your own contact form in javascript so i hope you understand that how to build one contact form in javascript and i hope you also enjoy this project like you know jack Ball, previous project of javascript so just you have to practice these all projects we are working with and i hope you will be a good programmer of javascript also like you are of python and html and css so i will just meet you in next project so for today good bye <laughs>